Oh my god. Dude, okay, listen. We gotta talk. What is it this time? It's about these mobile horror games. Okay, so listen, listen, hear me out. Okay, so I played Granny like you wanted me to. I can't do it anymore, dude. Uh, like I'm about to play this game called The Nun, and it's basically just Granny, except a nun. And it just looks so bad, dude. I don't want to play it. That's the bottom line. line. Don't the talk board. over me. I hate it when you Is do that. that. So listen, just, okay, fine, fine. I'll fucking do it. I'll do it. I'll record the video. Are you happy now? Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing The Nun. This is a free mobile horror game. Looks a lot like Granny, except it's starring a nun. So, Granny's a nun in this one. Let's go ahead and check it out. Eagles Junior School, progress report of Ronald Carter. The student has been very naughty this year and must be cruelly punished. The mother superior will be in charge of correcting the moral faults committed. A cordial greeting. The nun. <laughs> so she doesn't have a name or anything. Uh, let's play on easy, actually. That sounds fine. I'm not interested in a challenge just yet. She hears everything you do. Be aware, she can get anywhere. You must hurry to leave school. Day one. It's even got the uh, day introductions right before the gameplay. I have to leave this school. I am Ronald Carter, and I'm going to be good. You have to be good. So, did the nun have to write lines too? We only wrote three, that's not gonna impart anything. Okay. Yeah, this is granny, isn't it? Okay, whatever, we're over it, right? Old book, let's take a look. This nun thinks only about the devil. I think that would be a problem with employment. So, they've just got this satanic literature lying around? Where anyone can see it? Right, okay. How is this nun not fired? She's burning an upside down cross! Half the floor is missing up there! What is this? Crowbar. Oh, cool. So where is the- oh, there she is! <laughs> she hits you over the head with a sledgehammer. Dramatic tone shift. Two million reviews? I don't think so. I don't believe that for a second. So yeah, that was an ad. There are ads in this game. I know I can turn them off by disconnecting from the internet. But I think it's funnier to have them in. Oh, hey, look. The crowbar. Okay, let's go out this way. This time. Ooh, you move fast in the vents. Now, since I made the sound over here, does that mean she's coming this way? There she is. Look at her go. Dude, she's got a key on her. We gotta get that. I like my little guy crouching. Very immersive little illustration. She go this way? Okay, so is this wooden thing all that's exit way out? This little wooden gate is all that's preventing us from leaving. Where'd she go? Laundry. It's blocked. That's a problem, isn't it? So I'm sure we can use the crowbar on something. Maybe something that's blocked off? With wood? It's an automatic blind. There must be a switch that- I didn't even hear her. There must be a switch that activates it. Well, I would hope so. Ow. Wow, what a great puzzle game. How much time do you think this shovelware took to make? Why would you not do all of the lines? Puzzled them. Classic puzzles. That wasn't a classic puzzle. Connect the dots is not a classic puzzle. 
I need to play some of these crap mobile games. I mean, I already am, but this one at least has, like, gameplay. Okay. She come in? Okay, she should come that way. Yeah, she's in that room right now. So we should be good to uh, move past. Wow, you move a lot faster going sideways. Look at that. Yeah, let's pick this up. Oh my god, I think that's wrong. <laughs> so what's up here? Oh. Oops, with this object does not work. Is she coming towards me? Oh god. I knocked over the picture. Maybe she won't see me here. I think it's safe. Oh, okay, I see. There's boxes on the other side. So you gotta push those out of the way, then push this one out. And then you can have... Oh, she's nearby. She's humming. Sounds like she's to the left. So we should be good to go in here. Wow! Let's close that. Drawer. What's in there? Locker code. Okay, we'll remember that. Safe box. Requires the safe box key. Note for Ronald Carter. That's us. Finally, I will take the safe box key with me. I cannot risk losing it. So wait, that note was for us? <laughs> Why would you leave that note for us? So I guess the safe box key is what she's got around her waist. Huh. Alright, so there's a locker code in there. I haven't seen any lockers that need a code. What's that noise? I guess she's around. Well, let's just stay in here. I'm sorry, I just noticed the gigantic blood stain. So I'm guessing she's the only nun here. How has this place not been shut down? See, Granny kind of worked a little bit because it's at her house in the middle of nowhere. It's in the middle of the woods, right? But this is a public institution, supposedly. So it doesn't make sense that, like, they're allowed to get away with this. There's a scale. Small cable. That's for the electric. Ooh, okay. That's for the electric panel. Okay. Radio. Don't turn that radio on. There's a spoon. We can get in here. Although this doesn't seem like a great hiding place. I'm just kind of checking things out. Scoping things out for now. I guess you could cheese her around this thing if you want. There's food cans, but why? There's a fork. Okay. So wait, can I drop this down here? Okay, I dropped it down there, so hopefully she hears that. Let's take the small cable. Yeah, she's she's walking around it right now. Let's... You restored the electric current that was missing. Okay, she's probably coming up here, because she probably heard that. We can go into uh, somewhere else now, I guess. Oh, I think she's inside. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! There she is! Hi, nun. <laughs> is she in that room? Okay, she's out there. Wow, she caught on to us pretty quick. Maybe we can see if she goes down. That's probably what this hole is for, right? I wonder if she kind of patrols randomly or what. Okay, we gotta we gotta make this open up. So that we can have a little escape route. Because it'd be good to distract her by dropping things up here. Going out that way. Yeah, that'd be really good. Move that.
Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. Move this all the way over, please. Now, does she hear that? I think she's coming in. Let's see if we can... There she is. Oh, look. Oh, yeah, she, she runs out this way. Okay, so we're figuring out a little exploit here. That's pretty funny, dude. Oh, look, here she comes. Oh, I'm not over there. I'm in here now. Oh, no, I'm, I'm out here now. <laughs> so she just hears things, and then even if she sees you, I think she goes and checks it out. Oh, what? She crawls? What? Dude, she crawls. She crawls. <laughs> I did not know that. Okay, I feel a lot less safe with that strategy now. That's actually kind of funny. Wow. It's amazing that she doesn't hear the locker. Because every time I close it, it makes a clanging sound. A lot louder than moving some cardboard boxes along the floor. But she never comes. Odd. Okay, so I'm assuming that we use the electric panel to open the metallic blind area, right? So then we can go in there now, I think. I don't think she's around. I think we would have heard her if she would. Oh! Fuck. Is she up there? We got a locker code. What's the locker code for? What's this sound? I think it means that she's very close. She's probably directly above us right now. Okay, I'm slowly figuring things out. It actually is a lot like Granny in that, uh... You have inventory puzzles and kind of similar AI. Kind of cool. Okay, since she's up there, let's go check out the electric blinds. Unless it makes a ton of noise when it opens. There must be a switch that activates it. Wait, is it not this? But I used this. What was this for then? That's really weird. I think it goes to this thing. Switch. Okay, that's a lot of noise. Can I just go in there now? I'll just go in. Oh, what? Padlock? So I need a key. That's a tease, man. Is there anything? What does this locker code go to? I'm assuming, yeah, not this one. Okay, let's, uh, let's try the granny strategy. Made a noise. She's gonna come check it out. Maybe? I hear her. Okay, we're good. Let's look for that locker. These are- these all just open, dude. I, I'm I'm finding no locker that needs a code. Scissors, okay. Old book. I'm not sure I want to drop it yet. I hear her walk around. I think she's outside right here. I didn't know that there was another area. Huh. <laughs> I'm actually having a little bit of fun here. Oh, there she is. Oh, she walked right past me. Big mistake. Big mistake. Huge. What's out here? What, there's a ball? 
Oh my god, there's another wing! What is all this? What the? Oh, the crowbar. Use the crowbar on that thing. This map is really big compared to Granny, actually. So we gotta get the crowbar. I can't remember where I left it. Oh, it's near the sacrifice. Toilet paper? What would we even use the toilet paper for? Let's check all the stalls. Goat's head? <laughs> Clearly this place is abandoned, right? I don't like this door just being open. It's closed with key. Okay, let's keep going. I'm gonna go get that crowbar. Oh, there she is. I think she's feeling a little sick. Okay. So I dropped the locker code there. She's muttering something to herself, weirdo. Okay, made a big sound there. Can go through the vent. We're gonna open up that locked space. We're gonna go faster by going to the side, which I can't believe is a thing, to be honest. Look how fast we move. I mean, it seems like it. Oh, I think it's when you combine two at once. If you, if you press up and left, you move faster than if you just press up. It can't be removed, something is holding it. I have a crowbar! Are you telling me the crowbar's not used on- oh. Move, dude. Are you- It just dropped in my way. Oh my god. Okay, where does this vent lead? Ah, into the hidden room! The one that's locked with key! White blanket. It's closed with key. Aha! Okay, got the white blanket. I dropped in there. What's she gonna do? Is she gonna break in? What can she do? I'm interested to see. Will she break open the door? That would be convenient for me. She's coming over. Oh, she opens it anyway. Oh no, she can crawl. Oh my God. Sorry, that was an overreaction, but I just, I wasn't sure. Cause I saw her crawl earlier and I didn't know. If it was like a thing or not. Oh. That's fun. That's that's kind of fun. I, I kind of like that. What do we use this blanket for though? Oh, this is open now. It seems that from that window you can see the gym. What? Oh, hi. <laughs> can I go back in? Rope holding mannequin. Oh, this is what the scissors are for. I finally figured out something. Skeleton body. Object place one out of three. What if I put something on? <laughs> yeah, okay. What is all this? Are there any objects? I think she might be coming up. I think she might be. Okay, so I need to go get the scissors. Cut down the mannequin. Oh, I bet you put that goat head on this. Why am I doing this though? What? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense why I would do all this. So is this the locker? What 
is she saying? Say her own name over and over again. <laughs> what a weirdo. Okay, so I didn't even see this, but yeah, that's that's definitely what you use the scissors for. Hopefully she didn't go up here. Oh. Ah! Go. She coming back here? Okay, wait. Let's get her to go in here then. Dropped it. She'll go in there. We'll go behind her. This is way faster. Okay, go up the stairs. We gotta cut this thing off. Okay. Don't. You have dropped the team mascot to the gym. Cool. Is she gonna- There she is! <laughs> She's booking it! <laughs> Look at her. I think she might know that I'm here. Yeah, that's right. Go. Oh, yeah. The AI is kind of bugged. She, she knows that I'm there. Okay. So I need to go get that goat head. Oh, crap. She following me? I don't know. I don't think she is. Yeah! Okay, let's get her to do this again. Because it's funny. Okay, I'll just leave it there. Because I gotta go get that goat head. Pretty sure you put that on the skeleton's body. There she goes. She gets so enthusiastic. So what's this? Eagle's wings. Huh. Do you put the eagle's wings on the skeleton too? The skeleton's the only thing I can figure out to do anything with. There it is. Goat's head. Like, I, I don't know what else to do. There's like, there's a spoon. There's a fork. There she is. She's looking at her belly. I think she turned around. Huh. Wondering if I should go this way. Oh, there she is. Okay. Well, that means it's safe to go... This way. It's really funny that you can double your speed just by going a uh, diagonal direction. Let's see if this works. Object place two out of three. So the only thing I can think of is the eagle's wings. Uh-oh. Can she get me out here, by the way, if she was in the room? I would think that she could. I don't really want to know. There she is. Diagonal hacks. I know I'm playing on easy, but you know. Let's pick these up. Dropped them. Man, she's so easily fooled. It's great. There she goes. I can hear her. Yeah. Let's get these then. So what am I doing? Oh boy. Okay. Let's put it on, I guess. Object placed three out of three. Neat. We made some art. The skeleton is already completed. It looks like the devil. Does it? I mean, sure. So as the- oh my god, oh my god. Ah, oh, crap. The nun will be praying for 20 seconds. What? You're not even looking at it. Oh, 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 you fucked up. You... You messed up. 
I got the safe key now. You've entered the key. Master key? What? Really? Does this get us out? What? You have left the school. Great ending. Awesome ending. Perfect. Oh, and an ad. Why not just play with your actual pet or a real animal? What is this? Free download. It better be free. Six million reviews. I don't believe that. No, sir. <laughs> Six million people have the stupid cat app. I don't... I don't think so. Okay, so that was the nun version 1.0.6. Hey guys, look. You can rate them out of two stars. <laughs> How many stars out of two would you say this game is? Uh, yeah, so that was pretty bare bones, wasn't it? You know, I don't mind if they make a Granny ripoff game, but this doesn't have the same complexity that Granny did. The puzzles are crap. The only items that you need are you need the crowbar for the wooden plank, you need the locker code to open the locker to get the scissors to cut down the mascot, and then after that you just use the goat head, the eagle's wings, and the white blanket to uh, complete the devil, and then you use the safe key to get the master key. And there's so many items in there that I was like, what is this used for? Like there was, there was canned food, there were many old books strewn around the place, there was a spoon and a fork which do nothing. I was trying to figure out like, what clever puzzle will these be used for? And there was a scale in the kitchen and I was like, maybe there's some puzzle with putting old books on the scale or the canned food. And there's just nothing. And it's, it's really a shame. There should definitely be more puzzles. I think, I think the nun is really missing some things that made Granny a uh, adequate game. And that's the inventory puzzles. Just running around this ridiculous, uh, school. Abandoned school with blood streaks and upside down burning crosses and satanic literature and severed goat heads everywhere. Uh, it's not- for, for one thing, the environment is much worse than in Granny. I like the bigger map, but there's a lot of pointless space, right? And it's a less believable scenario than Granny. Granny's already kinda unbelievable, but at least you can see how something similar could happen. With this, there's no way. I I like the nun a little. I think the sledgehammer is not the scariest weapon they could be holding. I would like it a lot more if she was carrying something that fit the nun theme a little more. Uh, but whatever. Sledgehammer works, I guess. I do like that she can crawl in the vents. That took me by surprise, and I did like that. I I like some things about the nun, but there's just not enough of it, and it comes across as kind of a lazy ripoff to me. Which, maybe some of you figured that out as soon as you saw it, but until you give it a chance and you play the game through, you can't know for sure, so that's what I did. Because as, as you guys know, I don't mind Granny as a game, uh, and I'd like to, I, I'd be happy to play different versions of it, possibly improved versions, but this is not one of them. It took the formula and it did nothing with it. So yeah, I would say uh, one out of two stars for me, <laughs> if I were to rate them. It says we will improve the game thanks to your feedback, so consider this the one piece of constructive feedback you're probably going to get, because most of the people playing this game are kids that will just say it's either awesome or it's a granny ripoff and they won't say anything constructive other than that. Uh, there need to be more inventory puzzles. It can't be that easy I, to, to get out. 
there, there should be more gameplay mechanics. It'd be nice if you could defend yourself. There's a lot of problems, but it definitely could be improved. I don't think you can just wave a magic stick and make it into a good game, but it can be an improved bad game. <laughs> I think it has that potential. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys thought about The Nun as a game and about this video as a whole. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Think critically. <laughs>